Hi guys, and welcome to today's video. Today's video is all about the pug. Before we go on, don't forget to like and share if you really enjoy our content. Please hit the subscribe button to get notified when we post more dog-related content. Also, if you're struggling to train your dog or are thinking about getting a puppy, then affordable online professional training is what we suggest. See the link in the description and the pinned comment for more info. Pug Overview Pugs are an ancient dog breed of China, with roots dating back to at least 400 BCE. Emperors of China kept pugs as lapdogs and treated him to all the luxuries of royal life. The pug may be related to the Pekingese, though some believe the breed descended from the bulldog or mastiff. In the 16th and 17th centuries, pugs became popular among European royalty. Records show the first pugs imported to Europe came with the Dutch traders, who named the dogs Mopshond. Pugs became the official dog of the House of Orange in Holland after rescuing Prince William by giving him a signal that the Spaniards were coming for him in 1572. In 1688, William III and Mary II introduced pugs to England when they arrived to claim the throne. The pug was first registered with the American Kennel Club, AKC, in 1885. First, let's look at the pros. Pugs are little dogs that are ideal for compact spaces such as apartments or rooms. They have a friendly and lapdog temperament, get along well with most people and pets. Have fewer exercise requirements, just a daily walk or run would suffice to maintain it healthy. Not too destructive or ferocious, you won't have problems with destructive chewing habits or attacking visitors. Good option for dog novices, you don't need to have extensive dog training knowledge to train a pug. Show lapdog behavior, they will follow you wherever you go around your house and leave your side. They are not so active, but they will still love to go for a walk with you. Moderately easy to train basic commands like sit, stay, no, bed, go out, down, and come. These dogs are not known for loud barking and hence are neighbor friendly. Friendly and social, they make great company for single and elderly people. Good watchdogs but they won't yap endlessly like some of the toy breeds. Pugs are great with children due to their affectionate nature and kids love pugs. Now, let's take a look at the some cons. Lack of daily exercises like a walk or run can easily have them gain weight and affect their health. Shedding. Anything a pug touches practically turns into a pug, because it is covered by their fur. Pugs are also not superiorly engineered to fight the extreme cold or hot. They are prone to various throats, ears, eyes, folds, facial infections, and breathing troubles. It will be difficult to train a pug to do not so easy activities even if you hire a professional. Don't abandon your dog or neglect it, it will eventually start suffering from mental anxiety. Due to its flat face has narrow airways, making them very prone to snoring. These dogs won't be able to lead an active lifestyle so they won't join you for a hike or a jog in the park. Pug's small nose make it difficult for them to cool themselves off in hot weather. In winter, protect your pug from the cold by clothing him in a winter dog coat. Interesting facts, in Holland, the pug is called a mopshond, which comes from the Dutch for to grumble. Around 1740, Roman Catholics formed a secret fraternal group called the Order of the Pug. They chose the pug as their symbol because the dogs were loyal and trustworthy. Queen Victoria is another pug enthusiast and is thought to have owned up to 38 pugs during her reign. Pugs are well known in India, as its leading telecom company Vodafone has a pug named Sheikha for its mascot. A 1745 portrait of painter William Hogarth and his pug Trump can be seen at the Tate Gallery in London. On average pugs can run at a speed of around 3 to 5 miles per hour. Since pugs have a flat nose, they can't regulate the air they breathe which may result in increased heart rate. They've appeared in films include Men in Black series, The Adventures of Milo and Otis, and Pocahontas. Appearance. Pug has broad head and short muzzle with smashed face appearance. It has wrinkled face, big eyes, short legs, compact, square-shaped body and curly tail. Pugs weigh approximately 14 to 18 pounds, and grow to be 10 to 13 inches tall at the shoulder. According to the AKC, 
Pugs are commonly available in black, fawn, apricot, and silver fawn, rare color. Pugs are distinguished by their curly tails that curl up towards their bodies. According to the AKC, the double curl is perfection. Pugs are generally healthy dogs that live an average of 12 to 15 years. The average male pug lives about 12.8 years while female pugs have 13.2 years. The pug's pregnancy lasts about 58 to 68 days on average, and she has 4 to 6 puppies at that time. In general, pugs love to sleep from 12 to 14 hours per day. Grooming. Despite their short coat, a brush will be needed once every week. A soft bristle brush and slicker brush are ideal tools to use on their coat. Baths should be given once every three weeks and they are known to pick up a doggy odor quicker than other. Their bodies can't tolerate cold, so they should be towel dried instantly. Prevent gum disease by brushing their teeth three times a week, although vets do recommend daily. Don't forget to clean their ears at least once a week, trimming any fur blocking the airflow to the ear canal. Trimming the nails every six weeks and cleaning the eye area daily. Nose care is needed but usually every one to three weeks in the wintertime. Shedding. Although they have a short and smooth coat, pugs are considered to be a heavy shedding breed. These canines are known to shed their fur on a regular basis and that too in ample amounts. The reason they shed so much is because they have a short coat with a short hair growth cycle, and an undercoat that is continuously growing and pushing out the top coat. Cost. On average a pug puppy will cost $1,175 in the USA and most puppies can be found between $600 and $1,900. The average price of a pug puppy in India is around 15,000 to 25,000 rupees. Price range can vary based on the dog's quality, lineage, location and quality of the breeder. Exercise and trainability. Pug should only need 40 minutes to an hour of exercise per day, according to the UK Pug Dog Club. This breed can overheat and tire quickly. For this reason, multiple short walks should be taken throughout the day. Breathing problems can also be increased due to vigorous exercise, including the risk of heat stroke. It's crucial to remember to exercise them in the cool weather because of their intolerance to hot or humid weather. Intelligence. According to The Intelligence of Dogs by Stanley Coren, Pug is ranked 57. Understanding of new commands 40 to 80 repetitions and obeys first command 30% of the time or better. Swimming. Pugs are not born to swim and may not get excited about being around water. Due to their short snouts, Pugs may have more difficult time breathing while swimming. However, every pug has their own individual personality. There are definitely some that do love water. Barking. The truth is that they do bark, but usually not a lot. They do vocalize whenever they need something from their owners or when they don't trust someone new. They are normally quiet canines and when they do bark, it may sound like a yodel. They also make some small, yip, sounds when they get overly excited. Weather and climate. A pug is not the kind of canine that can comfortably reside in very hot places. Their tolerance to heat is pretty bad and if special attention and care are not given to them, then there is a high chance for a pug to get sick due to excessive heat. It's also crucial to avoid any outdoor exercise on a hot day because it's dangerous to a pug's health. Their tolerance to cold is a bit better than their resistance to heat. Still, these canines are not made for very harsh and chilly climatic conditions. When the temperature outside is pleasant and balmy, these dogs thrive. Friendliness. Pugs are a sweet, snuggly, and affectionate breed with lots of love to give, and they'll quickly bond with children. Many people believe that pugs and kids to be a match made in heaven. Your dog will be more likely to play along with other dogs if they have been socialized from a young age. Some dogs may be scared, nervous, or more vocal, especially if they have grown up without any pets. Pugs are always immensely affable and affectionate with other canines. Pugs get along with cats just fine, more so than any other breed of dogs. Most pugs can get along with cats, but it will depend on the personality of the dog. All animals have their own distinct personalities and some pugs may be scared of cats. Pugs don't see a cat as a threat, or as an object to chase. 
they are also not aggressive. So when a stranger enters the house they will bark at him but as soon as they see a friendly gesture and the potential for petting, they will stop and run towards the visitor wagging their curly tail. These canines warmly greet the people who visit their house and are highly cordial and amiable with them. Adaptability. Pugs can be one of the best companions for apartment life. It's a toy breed that adapts well to living in small spaces and doesn't require a lot of exercise. They are dogs with a friendly and social personality in addition to being a relatively quiet breed. You don't have to worry about them destroying property or acting aggressively toward your neighbors. Hence, their small size and an active lifestyle make them a pretty decent option for first-time dog owners. Their small size, low maintenance requirements also help in making them a really good option for first time. House-trained adult pugs, 18 months old, normally can be left alone for 4 to 6 hours a day. Puppies should not be left alone for more than 1 to 4 hours, depending on age. 8 to 10 weeks old pups cannot hold their bladders, they can be left alone for less than 1 hour. Guard, watchdog, pugs are not good guard dogs, however, they do make a great watchdog aka alarm dog. Whenever these dogs smell someone suspicious or unknown around their property or in their homes, they will most likely bark or yap in that situation and in the process, they will alert their owners. Drooling. This brachycephalic breed tends to slobber quite a bit, since pugs have compressed jaws, large and loose lips, and are prone to overheating. Pugs also drool whenever they are about to eat their meal or they see something delicious, apart from this, these canines are not known to drool excessively without any triggering factor. Have you had any experience with pug? We'd love to hear your story in the comments below. Thanks for watching this video and we will see you in the next one.